David, on this most precious of days, as we enter into our marriage, I vow to love you and care for you, to cherish and honour you. You are my soulmate, my first thought and the beating of my heart. Your love for life is a joy in my soul. I share with you my heart of love in all its beauty and uniqueness. Today, I vow to be your anchor, your best friend and your loving wife. Moving into marriage here today with you is my heart's desire. Alicia, how lucky am I? Here I stand before my best friend and step into marriage with her. Nothing has ever been as precious as this moment. I love you with every fibre of my being. I thank God every day for having you by my side. Your energy for living is boundless and every day with you is such an adventure. I vow to love you and care for you, to honour and protect you, to place you in the centre of my heart and soul. I vow to be your loyal husband and I will honour and adore you. I vow to make you laugh and I promise you a future together marked with devotion. So this is the art of marriage. Happiness in marriage is not something that just happens. A good marriage must be created. In the art of marriage, the little things are the big things. It's never being too old to hold hands. It's remembering to say, I love you at least once a day. It's never going to sleep angry. It's at no time taking the other for granted. The courtship should not end with the honeymoon. It should continue through all the years. It is having a mutual sense of values and common objectives. It is standing together, facing the world. It's having the capacity to forgive and to forget. It's a common search for the good and the beautiful. It is establishing a relationship in which the independence is equal, the dependence is mutual, and the obligation is reciprocal. It's not only marrying the right partner, it is being the right partner. It is discovering what marriage can be at its best. <laughs>